My name is Ephraim Amari Siyum. I am uh, one of the sons of Amari Solomon and the Gisti Geber Hewitt, who started this restaurant here called Dahalak. We've been here for about 26 years. My father and my mother, they, they fled from Ethiopia as refugees. My mother actually started this place up as a lifelong dream. She wanted to introduce people to our culture and our food by opening up a restaurant. This one, when I opened it, it was Indian restaurant. So people, they came for uh, Indian food. Uh, then I, I told them that this is not Indian food, this is Ethiopian Eritrean food. So, oh, let's try. When they tried the stick, they kept coming and coming. Without advertisement, people, they start to come. The, the injera itself, that's like the staple of, you know, Eritrean Ethiopian food. Our injera, as it is, is its own work of love. You know, by my mother, that's like, it's, it's grown, it's made from this culture that's fermented and this batch that's been just like aging for years. So the sourdough is always, we keep it on the fridge. So it's almost like 30 years. I keep like, uh, re, like what do you call it, renew it with the flour and water every day. So that's what it is. The ginger, the serve is a flatbread. It's, it's also like a utensil. And your right hand always use it for eating ginger, and left hand always for drink. I love introducing people to the food mm -hmm. for the first time. It's always been a thing with my father when he was around, and he would hand feed a lot of new people, people that don't know how to eat the food. Mm -hmm. He would like show them how to do it, go on their plates and kind of like hand feed them. Mm -hmm. That, that very act is called gorsa. This is like a, a tradition at home. It's kind of a sign of love. It's, it's more of a communal act. With the vibe here is, is what we're going for. It's more of a communal activities and things for people to feel involved in. Like uh, what I do here mostly is host events and we have like open mic and you know, crazy karaoke and stuff that happens on Tuesdays. That's my mother, my sister right there. They're carrying them the top of what's called a mess up, which is a, a hand woven table. And uh, it's my father right there. They would joke, like people would call him the mayor of Baltimore, <laughs> the Baltimore Avenue. Uh, so he's soothing, walking by and seeing that. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, me, my siblings, my sister, my brother, we're all blessed to have this. You know, my mother has put a lot of work into starting this business up and making the food here. And so did my father with just bringing in the crowds. and I'm currently uh, co-managing the place now, as it is. This is basically our home right here. And everybody that comes here are like guests that's visiting. That's the way I see it.